I'm not gonna change it. It's like it's the offline. We're not streaming right now. We're just gonna change but that live. Think, don't you think your audience should? Oh yeah, see sandwich. my offline image. There we go. That's a, that'll be my image when I'm not streaming. So you could just come and gaze at that for hours <laughs> on end. We're not streaming. Right now. Right now we're not streaming. The good old Kiryu in the corner. So uh, yeah, let's launch up. That Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy Remastered. I have not played this game since I did a video on it, like... Was it 2013, 2014? And we did a playthrough and it was the same footage anyway, so... This is our second playthrough of Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy. I, but it's a new... it's a new version. So it might look slightly better, it might look a lot uglier. I'm... Your, so your audience is probably like morons, and they'll probably say like bad for you or something bad for you but i think we should put it for a walk if we should play the game through in french oh that's okay yeah yeah we've got we've got some people in the chat right now and i've got it open on my phone and i can see that and we can play on test stream that was not a french <laughs> accent that wasn't that wasn't an accent that was some made up vocalization. you were going for an accent i don't you know keep going on. you keep going for accents it also, it's just, like, not it, working out for you. No. Uh, the game also does that when you get through the login through It just, like, stutters, opens the window and goes, Ah! And it finally starts working again. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. So it's David Gage game. All right, so Noonan was yelling at me when we were doing some setup pre-stream. And he was like... Oh, it's not in that menu. Sorry. Languages. That makes a lot of sense, to be honest. He was saying we should play through the game in French with English subtitles. I disagree with him heavily. <laughs> but now he's decided to make it democratic and it's like, okay, what do you prefer? French audio or English audio? I'm for English, Noonan's for French. Either way, the subtitles are English. Give, it, give, it, give, give us your reasoning for why the audio should be it's consideration for people watching this who are just like listening to it while doing other stuff. They just want to hear a bunch of French bullshit behind us. But I feel like it, like it makes it better because like, it's like two dudes commenting over a really like, like bad '90s French movie that came out that like no one watched ever, didn't even get released with subtitles in <laughs> in the U.S. Oh, no, no, I don't want to blow like. you the fuck out right now, but. We've got no no votes for French, tons of votes for ah. English, and two votes for German. You see, it's because I called them dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Don't listen to Noonan. Noonan's just negative Nazi. Nazi? Nancy. Like, it's my southern negative accent. Negative Nancy. Thinking. Three votes for German now. I, I think we're sticking with English for the for today. If it makes you yeah, feel better, Noonan, really I, can make the, I can make the menus German. Oh, does make me feel better. <laughs> How does it make you feel? Damn, these boys are resoundly. You know, th you know, this is what I get for coming on to, you know, game analysis channel. There's just like no, no sense of irony here. There's plenty of sense of irony. Two, like several people requested German. That's the most ironic route we could have gone. It also doesn't say new game. It says new movie. So. David Cage was never lying about what he wanted out of the game industry. You know, this, this, you know actually, the new movie doesn't even make sense. You know, the new game makes sense. Because, but the movie stays the same! It's a new, no, but you can... The same. We need movie movies where you can you vote. Alright, there's also... I love this. I went looking in the bonus menu and I forgot about all this stuff. But look, boxing, car chase, shooting gallery, basketball match, angels, uh. the hidden... It just gives everything away. I mean, they're a bit better about it on all this stuff. But um, this is like... I don't remember if the other David Cage, Cage games even have an equivalent to just... You can find bonus points and you get bonus points throughout the game. Which, yeah, you get points in movies. And then you can just buy stuff with it. And we can just skip to the credits that. and just, you know, call it out now. Should we uh, say what the mission statement of this is? Because it's pretty obvious for the fact that it's the Sadness Trilogy. <laughs> Fahrenheit. We're going, to, we're, going, we're going to play through all of the Sadness Trilogy. Live. Live. That's literally it. In preparation for... I don't know. It's not a trilogy anymore, but it's going to be sad. Quadrilogy. Sadness Quadrilogy in honor of... Sadness Quadrology, we're doing Sadness Trilogy. I'm the writer and 
Also, we have heard about the recent stuff that's been going on with Quantic Dreams, with uh, all the recent controversy. We're kind of saving talk of that for when we do get to Detroit. This is us, like, preparing. We're getting ready. <laughs> We're just building up hatred for David Cage. Just gonna... <laughs> so we can release it all out. In one solid go. I changed the... Ca oh, that's spoilers. That is big spoilers. This what? tutorial, big spoilers. Uh, uh, Ah, oh, I forgot it was like this. So it's one of those games where it's like, if you take your thumb off the camera, it like resets to its default position. But it does that in first person mode as well. So it's like, my character's got a really bad neck. And it's just fighting. Well, it also is a manic, like, a crash tummy, so... Yeah, also, uh, this is... That's the main character's face with the eyes cut out. Uh, his name is Bob. Oh god, we're not gonna play Omicron, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but there's like a limit. <laughs> I'm not- Maybe? Maybe one day. I have to immediately back my to go, I can't say never, but I really don't want to. The, th the thing is, we've always wanted to do Omicron, but then like, just- The fact of it is, it's just like, nah. No one wants to see that. No okay. one wants to play that. I totally forgot I had camera controls. There we go. It has been a while. Oh, by the way, we did play the tutorial in French, and then you do actually have David Cage in French, which makes me really hopeful he also, like, dubs himself in Spanish and, and German. Because, <laughs> I don't know, I just want to hear David Cage in all of his various uh, voices now. David Bowie is in Omicron doing- I know, I know he's in. <laughs> it's still a bad game. It doesn't change. It doesn't change much. There are a lot of people in various medias. You have to watch everything that they're in. It's kind of like fucking ridiculous. I uh, need David. Let, let David Bowie be. Let him be. Let him be in that David Cage game. Doesn't matter. It's okay, guys. It's chill. Omicron was designed for people that hate themselves and reality as a whole. Sounds about right. I just like to imagine that David Cage, like, for like when he got Omicron, I'm gonna make a game, and then when he failed at it, it was like. Okay, well, the rest of my career path is decided. <laughs> Games are bad. It's movies, boys. God, was this- is this, like, really necessary? Like, wh one of the things you hear about game is that it just starts off with you killing a dude in a bathroom. But no, it starts off like this. Hey, it's I could've- It's a weird I... fucking <laughs> surreal experience. To the game's credit, I could've skipped this. But I want to re-familiarize, but it's more than just the audacity of this kind of game needing a tutorial when it's, like, very self-explanatory. Oh god, they've redesigned the Simon Says a little bit. It looks a bit less... Actually, no, I, I prefer the old one. I think this looks uglier. I'm very fickle. I don't even remember how it even looked like. It looks more... I don't think... I just think it looked more kind of squared off. A bit more angular. Hmm. This game has a full-on sex scene. Are we going to get that? I remember how to get it. It takes longer, though, like, you kind of- if you're a bitch to that person in the scene, they leave faster, and- yeah, this guy's sexy. What you feel, Noonam? You agree with my ideal? Is he sexy know, or of... nice? Is he a nice boy or a sexy boy? <laughs> God, Snake! They're- it's none! Let's be honest! Alright, let's, let's see if there's a hidden nice. left- There's not a hidden left or right option for go away. So, I guess I'm just gonna go with my gut. Sexy. Bob can't hear anything. He's in constant pain. In Fahrenheit, you'll only have a limited amount of time to make up your mind. So you better think fast. Better think fast. Oh, it's going down. Cage. Is he like... He's, ex he's, he's explaining that. They're recording his body. It's like he's very like... It's like his body is made out of tentacles. That's how he moves. I look... I love how bad like the crotch on his jeans look. Like... I don't know, they it's call so it in dark. shadow. It looks very dark. His crotch is just a black hole. Like, if you're gonna have your own, like, you'd you think David Cage would be egotistic enough to have his own mom be, you know, good looking at least. Oh, okay, I'm looking at the chat and, like, Ludicrous Fool 79 points out this This is a remake. It polishes up the uh, textures somewhat, but it removes a lot of the lighting tricks. So this game's actually gonna look probably look a lot uglier. Because, you know, a lot of atmospheric bloom lighting and such is just going to be gone. And it's just well, going to be very lighting. Flat. Oh my god, what is this? This so... is hideous. <laughs> <laughs> Where do I recognize the name Asper from? I, 
I, I've got vague negative memories associated with that name. Things are never quite what they seem. Mm. These petals, they weren't here in the original. So this what is, is our main petals. I don't get them. What? <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna visit Japan in spring and just go to the cherry trees. That was our character's planned holiday before the fucking apocalypse started. <laughs> this is David Gassman. He appears in every David Cage game. I do not know how. Like he has range. Like he, in fucking Heavy Rain, we're gonna see him like three times playing totally different characters. At least two of which are fucking ridiculous. But this is like, David Cage is like, hey, just play, just play a kind of boring guy and I'll give him a cool name and that might make people think he's a main character. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> this, this, this is a movie. Oh god. Asper, oh, they made the PC version. Yeah, I play through the PC version of True Crime New York City. It's rough. The controls are kind of fucking abysmal. Like, learning to play that was genuinely a terrible experience. This script had a fucking manager? <laughs> These tools had a manager? <laughs> Everything had a manager. It's on the players to manage to get through it. I feel like this would have been a lot better with... Well, a lot more palatable, even, with a French dialogue. You know, Just... uh, probably yes, but people vote for <laughs> English, and here we are now. You're, you're just going to spend the rest of this stream just going, we should have picked the French. It would have sounded people better voted, in French. People voted for knowledge, and they shouldn't. <laughs> hey. They should lay in their misery of unknowledge. Starsky and Hutch unknowable. had gameplay. I mean, this has gameplay. This opening is genuinely good, like... It's all gonna be downhill. That's the more. That's all. The only thing everyone who well, hasn't played it knows about this game is yeah. That it, it's like that it has an intro, <laughs> and it like I feel like the intro is also. I mean, I guess it's good for what it is, but I mean, it's, it's a still... fucking. It's an opening. It raises a bunch of questions. It's like really dynamic. It leads into the next scene. It sells the idea of interactive movie that you can affect really well. And uh, then the rest of it's just gonna kind of flatline on that. Like, there'll be a few instances, but nah. Nah. Like, I was gonna go and restate. Like, this is the best David Cage game. Like, Heavy Rain. Yeah. But I'm not, I am not looking forward to revisiting Beyond Two Souls. I don't think you are either, Noonan. Mean, that's just gonna be 16 hours of us just kind of. Honestly, saying, out of all yeah. the games we were revisiting. I was like the most hesitant about this one. If I'm really? Honest. Really? Why yeah. is that? I just remember it being very boring. <laughs> <laughs> As opposed to Beyond Two Souls, which was a barrel of laughs. I mean, none of them are interesting. Actually, the most, the one I was looking forward to the most was probably Heavy Rain. Heavy Rain. You're just in a different dream. Heavy Rain has an awful opening. Like you don't, you don't love five camera shots of the same mostly naked man, and then he just wanders around his house being really happy. <sighs> that scene. Okay, the opening scene in Heavy Rain is just fantastic for just how on the nose it is of like I'm gonna take everything away from this character. Uh, but let's talk about this right now. So we got Lucas. Kane, he's about oh, to become is... a lot less interesting. Like, this is the most this... he did. This... I don't remember this scene taking forever to get its fucking point cross. What is this? That's the indigo child. It's the indigo child. There's just little, like, loose, like, com like plot points attached to us killing this random dude. Oh, by the way, while we're learning to stream in real time... Also, we've already got a witness murder that fucking crow. Get him out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be a bit more than depressed, but hey, we gotta start somewhere. <laughs> Handling it well. Uh, what's our policy on spoilers, Noonan? Are we just all full bore? Or are we gonna go along with the story? Like, what's everyone let's feeling? Go, let's go. Let's let's go along. Let's go with the feeling. You know, okay. we don't know what the fuck's going on. It's just, there's just a police. I I love the police uh, outfits here. They're very yellow. Oh, I'm it's gonna like... I'm gonna actually spoil one thing. Cause I see a comment in the thing. You can't game over BTS. You can just stop progressing. That's true. But there is exactly one game over in the game. But it's right at the end. It's one quick time event can get you not a game over, just a shittier ending than the already shit ending. So. Oh boy. 
So, he doesn't show you where he hides the knife, I don't think. Yeah, because, uh... That's one you don't get any choice over. We could just, like, book it if we wanted. I don't know. Should we play these games legit or should we try for the worst? See how far we can get. Because <laughs> I'm kind of interested. I might go for the worst ending on Heavy Rain. But with this, there's, like, three different endings. And I've only ever gotten the best one. Because you have to put in extra effort for the worst ones. I love that this is now, like... No, it was already a crime. But this is now, like, even, <laughs> like, ethically a crime. Like, what? Well, I mean... You know, he's depressed, but you gotta, you gotta do it for the health bar, Noonan. Ah, oh, damn. I, my also, you know, my character sight, also can't read. Out of sight, out of mind. That yeah. I'm not depressed anymore. That's exactly how it works. Uh, there's, this is, there's so many things I'm avoiding thinking about by doing the game. Yeah, alright, let's make myself feel a little bit better. A murderer <laughs> wouldn't blow dry his hands. That's bullshit. We can also, uh, we can also mop up. Oh, I didn't Actually, mean to we're do gonna that. do shit. I think you should just exit it out, covered in blood. I yeah, I'm already kind of regretting. Like, I've already gone too far with this. I've oh, already... can you exit with the broom? Oh, let's try. Oh, no, you can't. You can uh, mop uh. or back on... There it is. It's very binary. We can't just steal a mop and add to our list of crimes. Oh, boy. All right, I'm not doing this to cover up the crime. I'm doing it because of the janitor. I don't want to just, you know, cause a ruckus. People gotta leave early. Get home. Let's just he examine so, my handiwork. He seems so proud of what he's, like, done. Yeah, he's like, he's man, like, yeah. I could have been a janitor. Fuck working at a bank. <laughs> you know, I, I can imagine David Cage just, like, coming up with sort of interesting opening scene, and then he's like, hmm, I guess I have to make this into a video game. <laughs> okay, uh, that is, like... See, let's... <laughs> that is genuinely, to me, like, I think that is the only strength David Cage has. It's... Whoops. <laughs> Just accidentally started pissing. I hope no one walks in here or they're going to. <laughs> oh, there's bloodstains everywhere. I, I thought I'd be able to clean them, but no, nah, it's just... I guess I can go for another, but let's uh, let's get going, shall we? It's been a long night. Oh, Wait, you're not going to wash your hands? I think I already Say did you're that. You're not going to wash your hands after touching your dick? I'm not going to... Oh, he's coming. Uh, I took too long. I hope he arrests you for not washing your hands, you fucking disgusting freak. I didn't pay my bill either, I'm just... Uh, <laughs> there's a homeless man you could talk to back here, but there's no time. So there's two choices for how we can escape. We can take the subway, and uh, that doesn't create evidence. <laughs> or we can take we a taxi, just... and that creates evidence. I think we should just run in a circle. <laughs> Maybe if the cop just thinks we're too stupid to have done the crime, we'll be alright. Alright, uh... I'll... Where is the Can subway? we steal a car? Can we, we steal can't. a car? I don't think so, actually. Maybe. I've never tried it. I just committed a crime. Gotta move. There we go. I've just created evidence. Yeah, well, I'm gone. I'm out of here. Brooklyn? Just to Brooklyn. I'll huge... figure I'll figure my way out from there. That's a massive affair, dude. I'm so uh, sorry I blanked the homeless guy. <laughs> Who the fuck? So if you don't go to the homeless guy, the homeless guy will just walk out and be like, hmm, I guess you didn't find me, mother... He'll, he'll be back. He'll be back way later when this game gets worse. David Cage really likes his homeless man motif. Yeah, he does, doesn't he? Like, how many homeless people were there in fucking... I don't think Heavy Rain had a memorable homeless character, but... There was the homeless conclave in Beyond, and this game has, um... We're gonna be seeing a lot of heroic homeless people as this goes on. And, like, Detroit. Everyone in Detroit is basically homeless, so... David Cage romanticizes homeless people a lot. Also, what were you saying earlier on about, like... It's like, he had a good idea and then he had to do the rest. I honestly think that's how David Cage operates. Like, he has one or two good scene ideas and then he tries to... Extrapolate a game out of them. I don't know. I barely think he has even good ideas to begin with, because a lot of them are just kind of... It's obviously... what? I mean, how many movies does <laughs> Indigo Prophecy rip off? I don't know. Like, a it, lot. <laughs> it rips them off so it, badly, I can't name a great fucking specific ex example. So we can play as both characters in this scene. Uh, I think we have to go in here before we're allowed to play as Tyler. Literally the most useless of the playable characters. And that's including the fucking main character's brother who appears in, like, one scene that you can play him. You can play him as, like, he appears elsewhere, but, like, 
fuck me. Yeah, they really should have only focused on maybe like one playable character. Hey, we saw I that in Beyond Two Souls and he fucked that one up too. He can't win. I mean, I feel like Beyond Two Souls or cohesive experience in Indigo Prophecy, probably. Even if it is dreadfully boring. Ah, that's a shit and unmemorable name. I'm glad he's dead. Get him off the register. How'd he die? With a blade, from what I could gather. But we should wait for the autopsy. Hey, I don't give a fuck about the autopsy. It's blade. It got killed. I'm, by I'm just gonna wait out. Let's see. Let's go with. Ta let's go with her gut. Oh, she just gives up. She couldn't think of a question. <laughs> she hates the awkward silence. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever then. I guess dude's dead. It happens every fucking day here. So, we kind of have to play this scene as both of them. Like, not fully, but there's some pieces of evidence that I think only Tyler can find. Dude, look at his phone! Is that a- is that a touchscreen phone? What is that? This game took place in, like, <laughs> 2009, I think. Like, it was in the future. Was it 2012? Fuck, I don't remember. Tell me in the comments. What- why would this game take place in- oh, I guess because the apocalypse, but that's, like, kind of irrelevant. Like, the mood is still early 2000s. Holy shit, look at that ass mood. So, that is amazing. Oh, wow. It Whoever you don't weird. play as just gives up doing their job and goes on their phone. Hope you're enjoying Flappy Bird. Did, I'm did gonna those solve phones the crime. exist in the original version? I don't remember. Hey, I don't, think, I don't think they made enough effort to update them. Like, I think the original, the, just pull out a Why are there phone. touchscreen phones in Indigo Prophecy? That makes sense. Oh, she won't talk to Tyler, so I've got her. Alright, Carla's gonna do it. Why, why won't she talk to Tyler? Tyler just doesn't like the coffee, so like, I ain't talking to you, bitch. What the fuck, Snake? <laughs> Alright, well. I'm, I'm, just I'm gonna... way too sober for this, Snake. I'll have, like, <laughs> oh, I also knew him before this if we could avoid getting drunk or high doing this, and that. I don't know, I might have to break <laughs> that rule by stream two. <laughs> I was just like, hey, I was Snake, like, hey, Snake. it's the Sadness Trilogy. Why would we make it easier on ourselves? I mean, there's something really sad about being inebriated while playing games. It's, it's my quest to find personal happinesses in the Sadness Trilogy for myself, Snake. David Cage can wallow in his misery. I will, I will rise above and find happiness. You, but like you're going to do it chemically. Movie. It's like that Will Smith movie. Where at the end he just what got drunk. I, I don't know, I haven't seen The Pursuit of Happiness. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, if you had seen it, that joke still wasn't funny. Does, does he get drunk at the end of Pursuit of Happiness? No, I'm gonna spoil it, he gets the job. Holy shit, he gets- He's, he, so, he gets the job and he solves a bunch of Rubik's Cubes. He seemed happier when he was doing the Rubik's Cubes, I'm gonna be real. Was that also the screen debut of our Lord and Savior, Jaden? I mean, maybe. <laughs> I <don't> <laughs> you <laughs> haven't seen it, I don't remember it, so... It might I have mean, been Jaden, it might have been just some kid. I mean, it could have been in a commercial or somewhere <laughs> before. <laughs> Jaden Smith in the commercial saying, Watch my dad's new movie, it's great. Or maybe he was like, like an extra in fucking Men in Black 2. I don't know. <laughs> uh, you gotta lead her out? It's fucking cold outside. Just go and, just go and wait in the cold. Just go and freeze. Don't get your can, coat. Can she get a fucking coat, guys? Uh, a little service here, guys. I'm sat at the table. Alright, let's go. Uh, no, I ain't feeling... You can... Yeah, feeling real good. Snake, I, I fucking hate you, Snake. <laughs> Expect a lot of me doing that bullshit because I'm very easily amused. Alright, where's that door? Snake, don't you, just, don't you just want to work in this diner, though? It looks kind of nice. Yeah, just, I think we should forget everything and open it up a diner exactly like this in New York. Comcom's Burgers. Nah, that's shit. Yeah, that was... <laughs> I wasn't listening, so I'm not sure what made her slightly happier there, I'll confess. I'm gonna spend a lot of this stream just kind of, like, talking to Noonam and just kind of playing this game on autopilot, because, um, I've actually beaten this game a lot. Like, not in recent years, but as a kid I beat it a lot, and yeah, I'm pretty confident I can do most of this on autopilot. Not well, but on autopilot. 
I love that she's flattered. <laughs> oh yeah, this is my man. This Let's is talk dude about you. Dying out here behind a bar, you know, a pub, a fucking hypothermia and fucking ridiculous snow, and like Tara's like, yeah, this fucking old flirt. <laughs> I'm not gonna talk about the murderer, but what's up with you? Someone get this fucking guy somewhere warm. He's fucking dying. Hey. Carla, stop looking so smug. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him, he's twitching around, he's fucking- He's, he's dying. having the time of his life, Noonan. He's clearly toasty. Ah, oh, yeah, this man knows what life's about. Let's ask him about the cold. Co wow, that was a shitty way of phrasing it. Like, hey, you want it to be more cold? I've got a fridge at home. You'll fit in it. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Okay. I'm gonna go. What? You claim this is a game about choice, but I can't bum a drink off the homeless guy. I fucking, of course the homeless guy will make you stress, Carla, you fucking upper middle class motherfucker with your fucking <laughs> Gucci coat. Oh, please yeah, make me more like, sad. Oh. Please make me more sad that I've been mildly inconvenienced. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> that made her sadder than the homeless man. <laughs> Every time I open a door and it's locked, you know, I'm just, it fucks me up. Is there I'm anything just... around here that will make me happy? Gas prices. No, that's laundry. Fat laundry prices. Can I be made happier? I have no idea if that laundry price is like, like legitimate or not. You know, is it like cool? Is that a valid price for laundry? I don't know. Any Americans? Any Americans in the stream? Do these look like good prices to you? Do these look good prices? I, I, I think they're good prices. Is that? I think. Uh, I I don't know if that's all for laundry. It might be all day special. It could be. You know. I, I just want to throw my- I just regularly throw my clothes in a washing machine for 24 hours and then come back from the next day. Alright, let's go back it- let's solve the crime. Should we maybe progress into the shitty parts of the game? Wait, can- wouldn't it be great if we could so like, all of Far Cry 5, where- or 4, or where they give you like a second option to win the game in 10 minutes. It would be amazing if David Cage put in an ending right here where we could find Lucas immediately and kill him. <laughs> There's a really good, um, there's a really good comment in the chat right now from Bat. If Carla tried to open ten closed doors, she'd die of depression. <laughs> and that's if she was maximum happy. Like, right now, she's down to, like, six. Actually, what's my count? What's the button to bring up the depression counter? How do I check my life bar? Wait, oh, good, my Where phone tells me. Wow, Tyler's in a worse <laughs> mood than her right now. Tyler's was just sticking around here in this dead body. What if they, like... It was like a gameplay mechanic. A dead body would always bring down you. <laughs> and you just die from seeing a dead body. Oh no, yeah, I might have made this unwinnable. Alright, well let's get the body out of the way first. Let's get the horrible part done. I don't know, I think this might actually make her happier because she's so good at solving crime. Damn, that's a dead guy. <laughs> <laughs> really work that one out. I played a bunch of Phoenix Wright, I know what's up. Like, considering, like, at the end game, the budget restraints of having, you know, right out Tyler, what's the point of having these two characters? It just doesn't make any sense. It's kind of, it seems kind of like I you're guess, stretching out, I guess stretching it out. At the stage I feel like they had gotten to, it maybe would have been more work to remove Tyler. Like, they just banked on having the resources to, like, this game I mean, was originally yeah, meant to be, like, three times longer. I mean, that's obviously what happened. Like, I don't, like, I don't think they should have, like, removed Tyler. I'm just saying, adding Tyler or adding Carla, I feel like Tyler should stay and Carla should go. Adding... <laughs> and I don't know, I think Tyler can... should stay right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is... Hey, I'm not pissing on the corpse here. You can't just take out your dick and piss. <laughs> In this current environment, Tyler, not cool. I don't know. I think it's the most beast move you can make to just piss at the crime scene. Wait, 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 wait. Did, did Tyler just flesh in Lucas's piss? I, well, I mean, you know, I don't remember. I wasn't looking, I was looking at chat. Because <laughs> I don't think you flushed either. And what, either, you know, you didn't wash your hands, you didn't flush. Snake, honestly, you're a disgusting, like, human being. Hey, I'm just role-playing. <laughs> What's in this? What's behind door number three? 
There's piss in here too. <laughs> it's gonna flush everything. Ah, no, sorry. That's where the knife is. Yep. That's where he hit it. <laughs> I make all these claims I could play this game on autopilot. I totally forgot. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna stop making any claims of knowledge right now. Promise going forward. It's a good thing this game's easy. Who the fuck is Garrett? He's someone back there. He's unimportant. I am leaving now. Man, if only this game was co-op in these scenes and you could just... Uh, <laughs> only I mean, it just does, one like, at a time. It's just like, I don't really understand. Like, uh, uh, like having you solve the murder you already just did seems kind of pointless. No, well, I mean, there's a few elements. It's like, if I had just bum-rushed out, it would have been... This scene would have been easier. I don't know, maybe they should have obscured more of this scene. Cause, like, they hid where he put the knife. I mean, I guess it's a cool concept for the start, but like, I just... It's like, like a just it's, of it. It's, it's like just a like tutorial going... of like, this is how the game should be going forward. And occasionally it is. It gets more constrained. Like you do, like Lucas is, Lucas is in the crime scene and the cops come by and just, just like, look at it. And it's just like, we're doing the same thing twice over again, basically all the time. I am totally unclear right now if I have done everything I can. So can we just fucking leave the diner stick. We're not here. We can't be here all day. Well, Lucas that's... is still out at large. He's at home planning his next banking. All right, let's let's leave. I don't know. We, we could have Tyler talk to the homeless guy, but I don't know. He might become sad, and really, someone here should be happy, even if like. I think Carl Actually, is still in better snake, spirits. Snake, snake, snake. Yeah. Try to kill Tyler. Try to kill Tyler right try now. Try to kill Tyler right now in this scene. Yeah, just make it in this in this part. Just try to make him as. I don't know if possible. you can die here. Uh. But try to get as close as possible. Just... I'm gonna have to pull out all the stops because in every scene there's like several things that will make you happy, several things that will make you sad. Oh god, this is where the subway exit. <laughs> oh, I love that camera. I mean, maybe I could try and get him hit by a car. That would make him really sad. Okay. <laughs> I've, just, I've got to just go <laughs> to the car. Uh, I just, I'm just i sorry, Noonam. I can't kill him. Ah, uh, what? You didn't even attempt to. You just... Oh, I what? think, yeah. I've got to get permission from my other player character. Why? It's not like... A, was there like a two-player option? No, there wasn't. It's just, let's leave! Oh, I aced this scene. I did it so good. It totally took me like five times longer than it should. Let's go. I hope I hope, the, I hope. the rest of your things don't take this long. I can speed up if you want. I could play this game properly. But where's the fun in that? Uh, you'll just play the game through it properly. And like I'll like... Audio of me going in the- Hey, wow, that's bad! That was cutting out a lot. <laughs> so, I don't know what you said, but I approve. That's perfect, that's perfect, Snake. Am I still cutting out? No, you're not. We're gonna have to work that oh. one out as well as we go along. Oh, uh, Have I been cutting out a lot? Yeah, here and there. That's not cool. That's so, not cool at all. Just in case you okay, didn't we get, get to it. see this whole- we get to see this, like, for a third time now, for some reason. But, he's got to do that! And that's, uh, that's it. He just had to turn around, look at you, all menacing-like, and, uh, that's the scene. Why? <laughs> we can't European extreme no trank. We've already killed a guy. It was out of my hands. How did he kill anyone? God, you should have bled to death. Yeah, really. <laughs> got a lot of blood. Bloody sheets, dude. Not a good look. Dude, I've been there. <laughs> no, <I'm just> <laughs> <laughs> All right. Get ready and go to work. I would not go to work. I would call in sick. But I would be suspicious if you called in sick. Like, if I called in sick and my boss was like, mm, "Did you murder somebody?" I, I would. I would. If, I just have to say it, yes. You know. <laughs> I can't get away with that. I can't go back to bed. You can't go back to bed because you gotta go to work. Don't be a lazy bum. All right, let's do this. Don't just hit it when you bleed on your bed and then you like have. Problem solved. 
No, it that it's that that is not a problem to solve. That I can't. I, Who the fuck could sleep with their window open in these conditions? Close that shit. What a brisk pace, though. I love that. He's fast. He's ready to run. Brisk pace. Brisk breeze, man. That's chilly. Also, um, oh. Oh, yeah, let's uh, deal with this fucker first. How's it going? Hello. I'm playing video games. Go away. Wow, you get up fucking early. Hey, how does the church look on murder? Like, I didn't do it, but I did. It wasn't me, though. I wonder if, like... Like, what is this, like, apartment even going for? Is it supposed to look decrepit, or is it supposed to look like Lucas is kind of rich? Because it... I mean, it's, he's he works looks... in a bank in a pretty high position. Wow, that is a stable phone. Okay, okay, okay. So, so, so he has an apartment, a big, pretty big apartment in New York City, which means rich. Rich is a banker, and like the kitchen looks like. I mean, his girlfriend just moved out. I guess she did all the furnishing. Like all of this was done up. Like she just, I'm moving out. We're breaking up, and she just ripped like... all of the wallpaper off. I wonder if like Lucas is like, like a weird artsy person who living room to look like, you know, like an old fucking apartment building that no one lives in. It's just like the paint's peeled off, everything looks fucking <laughs> like a mess. And a good point was made in the comments, like, saying you'd have to pay like three grand a month for this kind of place, and he's, he's living downtown. Like, he's presumably in like a high-end place. Like, th yeah, this just... is gonna be a thing with David Cage moving forward, like, everyone is fucking loaded. I'm more, I'm more curious about if, like, if this was, if the, like, the living room, kitchen, like, wallpaper, or, like, wall situation was, like, intentional, or, like, it's just, like, it's, like, it just, it's, it certainly has a feel to it. It could be intentional if that's, like, what Lucas is going for. Do you want me just kind of looks like ass. Do you want me to try and kill- Take the force! Do you want me to try and, uh, kill, uh, Lucas in this scene? Because I think yes. I can. Alright. Um... I could do it. I don't. I'm gonna have to beat the cop, though. Spoilers. Uh, there's someone who's a bit wary of us. Whoa, my hair just changed. I did, just skip him dyeing his hair a little bit because I think the lighting just shifted. And I, or or I think booga booga. a model change. <laughs> model change. Like, oh fuck, we gave bandage Lucas a slightly better hairdo. Just throw in some highlights. All right, let's get Lucas killed. Like. We've got a busy day ahead of us, so hey, no better time to die. Hang on, let's do this right. Let's do this right. If we're gonna kill ourselves. Oh boy. We're gonna kill ourselves. <laughs> trying to listen to some fucking depressing music. I've only got four tracks on this Santa Monica. I literally have no personality. You, that, your mood went up, Snake. I know, but it's fine, because... <sighs> Alright. <laughs> Don't worry, this will fix it. This will make me happier as well. It says don't take oh. alcohol. That is known in video game design circles as signposting. Ooh. Ooh. Can you feel where I'm going with this? Snake, you're being a really naughty boy right now. You being put on some emo rock, and you took some painkillers, and you're fucking drinking alcohol right in the morning. Time to go, baby. I love that it just looks like an oil bottle. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking uh, awesome that's oh, some olive oil. oil. That is the spot. I'm good and greased. <laughs> Warning label. Oh, I got an achievement for it. How dare you give that an achievement? That should be big secret. Uh, this, uh, uh, he dies immediately. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in TPH. I like, like last night killed somebody. Had no memories of it and went home. I like. You know, killing myself would probably be like one of the options I would think about at that point. Oh god, I also it's just like... checkpointing. I'm so sorry I did that. All right, speed run. Ignore the phone. Fuck my brother. That'll probably ring forever, actually. Oh. <laughs> out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> oh, if I talk to my brother right now, I'm gonna have to just meet up with him later on. I ain't about that. It's freezing oh god, cold. Why brother. would I go to the park? Uh, yep. I'm just gonna get out of my can't steam. Get a nice view of Lucas's ass. It's not like the you technology know... wasn't there yet. It'd probably be really flat. And David Cage was like, "I don't want it's people. Not like I don't dreams. want people to think I I can't do a French accent. I do not want. It's people not like uh, 
Do a French like accent. Quant- <laughs> no, it's not like Quantum Dream wasn't a fucking creepy shit show. I, I literally think it's a model change, dude. I think Yeah, that's- yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Are we gonna, we're, we're not going to see man-ass in this game. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, not that, you know, it probably does exist. Like, me and Noonan just beat um A Way Out, like, and that didn't just have man-ass. That game went all the way. Something. Sometimes you have to hack man ass and man cock in your video game. Yeah, yeah. This is fine. You like, need if it. If you're 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 a European developer of video games and you don't put a dick in your video game, come on, you're it's, European. It's <laughs> not a video game yet. You're not done. Go back. Go back. Add a dick into your video game. Did I uh, remember to do my sheets this time? And now time for another model change. <laughs> Was it like highlight my computer? Should I check my emails? Like, Ao from the Murderers Club, we're inviting you. You're a real boy now. Oh wait, I got I got a music option here. Fuck that. I love Amer. I love American fucking radio names. It's just like random letters and number. Over here we have radio station names, and it's like Sky Plus. Ring FM. Oh, we have we have a mix because we have like numbered stations in London, but we also like well, you know, Five Live and all that shit. Mm. Yeah, yeah d- do your fucking sheets, bruv. What is look in, in the fucking PlayStation Two version or whatever other version this game was on? Does fucking look as his face look like he'd been smashed in? <laughs> like he looks like someone just fucking knocked his face in. Oh, are you ready for the most depressing part of the playthrough? We gotta get oh, this one out of the way. Oh yes! Big moment. <laughs> <laughs> that will never not it's be always, funny. It's always amazing. <laughs> get out of me, strong bones. Ah, oh, good. I love that logo though. Actually, I've never looked at it before, but the milk with the udders under it—that's the most artistic thing Cage has ever done. Even though it was probably some designer. It's high brand milk. <laughs> this is my breakfast. I mean, it's doing a lot better than most people who don't eat breakfast. If you're not eating your breakfast or drinking your breakfast, guys, it's not a good look. Um, I think if you drink a lot in this scene, like, if you keep drinking, you'll get sadder and sadder, and then you'll die in a different way. Actually, we got the less funny death. I'm sorry to confess. This is duck. duck. Yeah, you were, you were really, like, going, you were, like, speedrunning that death. Holy shit. Bonus points. Is that Yu-Gi-Oh? Is that Yu-Gi-Oh? <laughs> I'm a big collector of these tarot cards that are also Yu-Gi-Oh cards. <laughs> I'm just gonna drink every from a, every available source in this house. Um I think my bloodied cloves are somewhere around here. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, uh this happened to me too, it just running around too fast. It fucks up the head. Yeah, yeah, you get a head rush. I don't know. I don't come 10% closer to death every time I get a head rush, no. Man, characters in the David Cage verse are really fucking fickle. No wonder everyone's so sad. Everyone has a flashback. It's just, it's just tragic. Imagine if you had a flashback in real life, Snake, and you just for some reason, dude, did all the manu- 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 movements that you were doing in the flashback <laughs> currently. You know? Like, you just have a flashback to you taking a dump and you just get into a prone position. <laughs> oh, that's the... You could you went with the worst possible one because, like, I ain't good at doing squats. Gonna confess. <laughs> weak legs. And I'd probably shit myself uh, and that's also a negative. I mean... <laughs> Snake. That's all you. <laughs> Let's be real. Like, that's... <laughs> I think if I turn on the TV, I'll become sadder. So let's do that. I hope there's something good on TV. Oh, is there some cartoons? No, there's no hot cartoons. David Cage hasn't paid for them yet. I love that, like, like main characters, when they open up the TV, they always open up, like, perfectly right as they on, the news, on the news story that relates to them. It's just beautiful. You know, like, in the age of 24-hour news cycle, fucking this wouldn't be news right now. This was news fucking seven hours ago. Right now, they're talking about something completely different. <laughs> Nothing happens in New York City, Noonan. There's probably been at least 15 murders since mine. Ah, oh, shit, my cable ran out! out. Oh, 
Oh god, they just keep reusing this animation. Okay, like, if, if the TV great. was gonna it's, do that, like, then Luke is, why? is stabbing his dick. Let, let, we're all thinking this, but it just looks like he's stabbing himself in the fucking crotch. <laughs> and, I, and it's like, keeps replaying this, and I wanna be like mature about it, you know, but it keeps repeating it. I'm just gonna sit like this. That is bad for your posture right there. That is terrible. Snake, let's sit like that. Let's sit. Oh. <laughs> I mean, let's, I've got. I've also sit. got a stream. Hang on. Let's just. Ah, that's just, a, my exercise for the uh, day. Uh, 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 yeah. Man, this, hurt my back. <laughs> this scene gives you more time than I remember. Like, this is the scene. Holy shit! A Th that's a boxing. That's up. box. Go box. Go box. Go box. Go box. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We gotta get our training in for when we rumble later. Oh, you oh, big baby. You. Big knife wounds on your arm, you're not gonna overblast it? You're never gonna be a boxer. Big. Guess guess you'll just play some sad music instead. Hey crow, hey crow. I'm gonna play some fucking big jams. Listen to this. I love it. What happened uh, last night. I'm not really into That's the perfect time to play the guitar. You could inspiration. You've just murdered a man Lucas. write your experience. Yeah, he's such a I... bitch. He just he like at least fucking Ethan did all the things he could to, but no, Lucas is just, you know, gonna get arrested like a dumbass. Ah, I hate him. He's like the worst fucking David Cage character. Haven't I already solved all of these problems? <laughs> what do you think about I mean, this, uh, Mr. Uh, you think? <laughs> he's, I, okay, I can't decide if this character is like the biggest pansy or if he's taking this in like really good. Hang on. Maybe if I blast some Santa Monica, the cop will come and he'll be like, I can't stand this crime scene and leave. Let's put on the other one. Wait, I got a book on Kung Fu? Oh, wow. Never mind. This game has no plot holes. It explains why he learns Kung Fu. <laughs> <laughs> We've solved it, guys. Space. Just, not even... Just It's literally just a book on the Kung Fu. <laughs> it's just all Kung Fu. No specific schools, it's all Kung Fu. And that's the book that's all of space with a picture of the moon. You need no other. I... I... I love... I only love two things... Oh no, three things. Cows, Kung Fu, and space, motherfucker. I ain't about anything else. If you come at me, you best know about Kung Fu, cows, and space. Hey! What's up, copper? I think I've done everything. I'm confident. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? What's going on? Lucas Kane? No! <laughs> no, I was just Santa Monica and wailing. I do that every night. It was me. Oh yeah, yeah, that was me. I cut myself on some broken glass and I freaked out on it. It was a plot hole, is it failure of the game designer? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah, come on in. You want to sure, listen? Sure, just go for it. Go for it. Can we? We can have a drink. You want to drink? Yeah, you want a drink? Want to listen to some uh, Theory of a Dead Man? What about we sit down and discuss Nietzsche? What happened to your wrist, eh? I cut myself on some glass. I told you, you fucking. Do you have any attention span? You cut yourself. You go all the way, don't you? Yeah, I buy a really big apartment when I cut myself. I mean. You don't really- you can't really see my wrist, so you don't know- Yeah, when. like, I'm wearing a big coat. I didn't put this coat on because I cut my wrists. Who cops actually do this? I mean, I, can, I, I believe a cop would, like, be so extra to come into, dude, because someone was making noise. But, you know... <laughs> Late like, at night, I've been hearing you boxing. Yep, I've what seen everything with my eyeballs. I'm not going to do any more investigation than that. What if you left the bed covers open? I think I, I, I would have wanted to see what this Steve would have done. You can refuse entrance. Um, there's a kind of suspicion meter, I believe, and I think then you have to pick dialogue choices to deny it. I think you can get through the scene like that. Oh, I don't remember. Okay, I'm gonna confess. Like, <laughs> this is gonna make me sound but so no, sad. No, I don't care. I don't. I don't care about you winning. I would have. I want to get arrested. Oh fuck! Don't you know yeah. I'm not in? But I've, got, I've beaten this game several times, but I, I'm i such a saddo that I played it through, like, without really testing stuff. <laughs> I didn't, like, see different things. <laughs> That's so lame! I You're know, like, I know, I'm, I know. I'm gonna know. play it through. 
I'm gonna play through this game like I was five like times I was like eleven years old, okay? Like when this game come like, out? Two thousand five to twelve? What? I don't know. I'm gonna be perfectly I'm gonna do <laughs> the most perfect moves that I wanna do. Every single I'm not even gonna step out of it. I was planning on becoming a big Fahrenheit speedrunner, even though that's the wrong way because you have to fuck up some scenes to go fast. Uh, what's, Boy. My, what's my messages? Yesterday at hey, yo, I hope you're not planning on murdering anyone tonight. I've got to meet you tomorrow. I I, I think there should be a David Cage game where one of the characters is like a sovereign. And, <laughs> and he's like, you get to pick all the dialogue options for it. It's gonna it'll be great. It's like a police officer comes up to you and you're just like, what? I'm not allowed to be here? Carnage. Ah, oh, carnage. That makes a lot more sense. Oh man, the newspaper makes me sad. I should cancel my subscription. Don't litter. I'm gonna put- I can't put it in the bin. It? You can't litter inside your own home. That's ridiculous. Snake. Snake, do you hear- listen to this. I'm littering in my room right now. I just threw garbage on my floor. Me too, uh... I just threw something on the floor, there we go. I'm in character now. Oh no! Alright, so it doesn't really matter which, but... What are you feeling? What's what's everyone feeling? We want to continue on with Lucas or we go on with Carla? Can we just continue on with Lucas? Because I don't... <laughs> Carla's got nothing going on. We. I don't know, we she's got her person. phone out. She's got the police station. Yeah, let's go to the park. Park, park is a lot more interesting than the police station. Let's be real. Yeah, I'd rather go to the park than the police station, so we will. God, Snake. I'm way too sober for this. I'm so sorry. This screen is way too white. Oh my it goodness. It burns the eyes, doesn't it? Ah, uh, this game should be darker and sadder. This, like, none of the snow should be white. It should all be piss yellow. Just to show you how sad it is. Oh yeah, Snake, you're not really talking about why you're streaming on your channel. Oh, true, yeah. I just, um, I just, uh, hit 200 quid on Patreon, um, so... Ooh. I'm gonna be trying to stream regularly. I, I'm gonna, I, like, have some games that I do want to stream, but me and Twice Adam, a week, right? No, 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 uh... Twice a week. Not twice a week. Did you misread bi-monthly? Fuck off. Don't put words twice in my mouth. Twice a week, mouth. that means twice a week. Twice, twice. Yeah, bi-monthly means twice a week. It means I'm going to try and stream at least once every two weeks. I'll try and work out what days are best for everyone. I might put up a poll later on, and I've got some games I want to do. Um, also, that B and N thing, B won overwhelmingly, but Yakuza 2 might come before the game that starts with B. I'm keeping that a secret, because I've got two games that are really obscure. Hey, will you make wait, me wait, sad? Wait, 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 said that you're going to be streaming twice a day, Snake. Is this... <laughs> This is like news update I've that got I got to, from I've got to channel. dispel the rumors that I'm gonna be streaming twice a day. <laughs> Holy shit, everyone everyone's agreed that you're streaming twice a day, Snake. That's amazing. Nunam, you, Nunam, you could only see my screen. What the fuck are you trying to lie to me for? What do you mean I can only screen it? I have my fucking phone out and oh, I'm looking oh, at Oh, wow, that. you- never mind, I, I thought you wouldn't think that through. <laughs> And they've decided that you're going to be streaming at least twice a day. If it was snowing this bad, I wouldn't get drunk and fall asleep on a park bench. So I've got to admit, I haven't done that like when it's not snowing yet. But the possibility is always open. I came close to doing it last night, so... Uh, wrists. What is that? I mean, I was just saying, you know, I mean, talk about the wrists. You can't really see. <laughs> just hold my arms up a little bit. Hey, you want to see the cut? The cuts, they're real gnarly. I love that Lucas trusts his brother so much and be like, Oh, dude, I have I did some crazy drugs last night and I killed the dude before I cut these things into me. I don't know. I guess I should have should not have done bad salts. Hey, how many Hail Marys is this? Like, how much am I going to have to pray to make this one go away? Like, as my spiritual <laughs> advisor right now, because like, I don't know, that guy... I didn't hear anything about like, it on the news. He didn't, like, do charity or nothing. Like, I wasn't going to have said, like, model citizen killed. They were just, like, he was just some guy. I feel like God would be, like, legit for, with Lucas right now. I feel like, you know, he'd realize that, oh, shit, weird shit happening here. You know, I'll, I'll let you go for a whole week. But after that, if you're still keeping up with this shit, you're going straight to hell, mister. <laughs> 
Uh, uh, like, maybe, yeah, do it like, do it like a classic adventure game. Like, hey, like, on God's behalf, I'm giving you a week to clear your name, Lucas. And Lucas like, ah, oh, shit. I gotta find out it was me that did it, but I gotta make it good. Okay, so, alright, David Cage, here's a concept for, like, you, okay? So, we do the same opening. Like, you know, you kill a guy in a bathroom, and it's like, ah, oh, shit. But then, like... You know, you got to prove that the guy was actually a bastard so you don't have to feel bad about it. And that's Ooh. the plot of the game. It's like, you know, it's like he littered, like beat his kid, cheated at poker, and then like just come out and say, I killed this guy, but he was a shit. And everyone's like, yeah. Snake, are you going to be doing these streams by yourself also? At some I, I don't think I can. I'm boring on my own. <laughs> I'm gonna have to find people who are regularly available so no one realizes. <laughs> I'm like, it's just got nothing to say. It's like, imagine like, a few months from now, you're just like, fuck, I guess I can't. No. Dreaming there alone, and you're just like, got nothing to fucking say for myself. Yeah, pretty oh, much. Just... Like, like, basically, okay, anyone watching this, I don't know if I'm entertaining. I'm probably not. But the only reason I'm half this entertaining is because Noonam is here. I'd be jack shit without him right now. Uh, I'm gonna convince him, you know, give up the cloth. Come just party with me. Oh, I thought I was gonna convince him to give up the cloth. Come be a banker with me. Well, David Cage has a very... Lacking understanding of many belief systems, so I'll probably get away well, with a lot. It's literally been 30 seconds and you already cry. I already what? I went quiet for like 30 seconds and we're already basically Sorry. Anyway, he gave me an extra life. Don't worry, Noonan, because I wasn't talking to myself, I was talking to the fictional character. Oh boy. God. There's a lot of people here. What's with the fucking crow? Because I don't... What does the crow even fucking do? Uh, he gives me visions and he's... You know, I'm being watched by spirits, forces unknown that will come into play later on. Wow. What a dumbass, eh? What a fucking chode. That's... A, that was a pretty weak ice right there. Yeah, I know. That was nothing. Um, so we get a big choice here. I mean, it's not like anyone knows what you fucking... Why well, is this like even a moral choice? <laughs> that steely gaze is it's already began. Oh my god, Snake. You're not going to. I did it. You, you, you did it. I did it. You didn't even have... Don't worry. I'll make myself happy in the next scene and forget about it. I love how the game is like, like, trying to give up, like, <laughs> excusing you from being a fucking prick. <laughs> it's like Lucas is post fucking commentary yeah. over his old axe, just like, if I had to, if I could have done that again. Only 30 <laughs> points anxious? Damn, ice Dang, cold. I think these characters had that, that fucking action should have fucking killed you right there. Like, just just like, dive in the river with die. him. <laughs> oh my god, 30 points? That's like three locked doors. <laughs> All right, who here can make me sad? Up. How about Snake, you? You're sitting, Snake. You're setting up a really bad example for your being scared by letting that kid die. What? What's the bad example? I'm just being honest. I wouldn't. I wouldn't dive in. Oh, the pure fucking honesty of letting a child drown in the lake. I mean, I would do more than Lucas the did. Paragon of honesty right here. I would do more than Lucas did, but, you know, I also don't have to cover up a crime. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Snake! You didn't save the kid! <laughs> you didn't save the game! The game has decided you're not worth shit! Oh my god, I hope it saves. I hope it <laughs> saves! I had auto saves on, it's fine. Hey, look at my Adachi desktop. I got a lot of comments about that on the last video. No, that's clearly Kion for Melancholy of Haruhisu. I've never watched Haruhisu from here, I've got to confess. Adachi, that guy, what's uh, the difference? Yes. Have you started drinking? Have you. Have you. Does, <laughs> is that better be a soft drink? <laughs> 